All right, guys, <clears throat> our YouTube uh, family out there. Hey, Tyler, where are you going? Hold still. I want to introduce you guys to, uh, this is Tyler. We'll call him TV. He's wearing the Smith goggles today. <laughs> so we can see it's kind of got, we kind of got a weird light out here. It's helping though, huh? Oh, they're awesome. He's doing 90% uh, of the filming today. And then we got uh, the old youngster, the intern. This is Riley Jordan himself. He's our straw supplier, so he builds up all the straw and then sells it to us for 10 times what it's worth. Um, but we're helping him go through college, so it's all good. And then we got all young guns. This is Marshall Anderson. He used to be the intern uh, six years ago, but now he's uh, moved up one level into uh, the senior intern. So he's our main llama wrangler at the ranch and gonna be helping us out today. Oh, old buddy. We call him old buddy. So let's go uh, jump into it. little bit of a breakdown here we have all the registration paperwork I have all the llamas names written down right here so we know who they are then we got a microchip we'll insert at the base of the left ear and then on the microchip it has a number and so we'll test it with our tester this is kind of a microchip reader so once it before it's inserted I'll check the microchip make sure it's actually reading and then we'll insert it and once it's inserted we'll put this over the um, ear to make sure it's actually inserted correctly and it is working. And then once it is, then we'll put there, there's a little sticker on these microchips and we just put it right here on the registration paper where it says um, microchip number. We just kind of insert it right underneath there. And uh, we need to microchip everyone, get left and right profile pictures. And so these llamas haven't been haltered, so they're gonna give us a little bit of a rodeo. It's their kind of first um, introduction to a lot of llama handling and we've been around them. You can see how they're pretty calm now where we're not asking them to do anything. But once we ask them to do something, they're not gonna like it. And so we try to be as quick and um, invasive as possible. We typically do it in a nice somewhat open area or within this barn we have nice solid walls or uh, you can use a fence line or a trailer. We don't want to put them in a place where they're really uncomfortable like a chute and they're gonna um, be bucking back and forth quite a bit. And so as many llamas as we have to do today, um, this kind of open quarters, I think it's gonna be the safest where we're gonna halt them up because we gotta get their pictures. And so uh, we're gonna just kind of do one at a time, get a left and right profile picture, microchip them, and go from there. So let's dive into it, boys. Okay, back up. Okay, now let's get to her other side. Okay, catch her. Is that just a soft spot you're feeling for? Mm -hmm. Okay. Four, six, okay, we're good. Okay, so you grab their ears. You gotta have some a couple strong boys unless you have a shoot. And you bend the ear. Once you bend the ear, it creates a gap right here. And you kind of push on it. And it's soft for about a quarter inch until you feel it hit the base of the ear. And that's right where you wanna stick it. You wanna stick on the top side of the gap until it punches. Insert it, pull it out. And if you do it right, 100% perfect, it won't bleed at all. Uh, little Cleo put her head through the gate and she pushed over the panels. So that's what happens, I guess, when you have a makeshift setup and we, uh, we're making the best with it. We got so much snow that we don't have access to our normal facilities. So this is what it is. So they all got out. So now we got to catch them again. And Marshall and Riley are uh, interning it up over the old lawn wranglers. <laughs> Watch them. Hey Marshall, you bring them through this side over here. Yeah. 
Do you want me to stand here? Okay, we're down to our very last one for the day. He may or may not be the strongest or the second strongest of the whole group. So, boys, you got your work cut out for you. His name is Astronomical. He's out of Starry and Top Gun. We just call him Astro. And uh, he's gonna be a beefcake. He'll be on the top 20 stud list one day. You'll just wait and see. I'm sure of it. Last microchip, gotta get pictures. And uh, then on to the next project for the ranch. Just need a picture of that side. Boom, got it. He's good. All right, nice and easy, boys. Let's do nice and easy. All right, Astro. Perfect, right in the corner. Easy. Easy. Perfect. He's done. That's a wrap. That is a wrap. All right. Open the gates and let them all out. My dad used to say that all the time. You know what I'm talking about, Riley? Cowboy. There's some real cowboy stuff right here. Okay, in turn. Okay. <laughs> He's even got a mullet. Look at that thing. Show it. Flash that thing off. Woo, doggy! <laughs> That's funny. Well, that's uh, one project done. All the babies from 2021 are all uh, vaccinated and we got the registration paperwork um, started. Just need to finish it and send it in. And we got all them microchips. So good project done. Time of the year where we wean everybody. So hopefully you guys like this little video clip and uh, just one part of the llama life. So if you guys uh, like the video, subscribe. We got more coming this year and uh, hope you guys are having a great new year. Thanks.